In this video, we will demonstrate how to allow third-party remote management software to be able to control Kaspersky Endpoint Security. A self-defense technology is implemented within Kaspersky Endpoint Security, which prevents unauthorized product disabling and other attempts to hamper its operation. To prevent malware from disabling protection by simulating the user's commands in the product window, self-defense accepts mouse and keyboard events only directly from a device rather than from other processes by default. Let us consider connections via Microsoft Windows Remote Assistance application. The administrator of ABC Incorporated plans to use this program to solve their users' problems. When solving an issue, the administrator has decided to temporarily pause Kaspersky Endpoint Security. Run Windows Remote Assistance on Alex Desktop, and request assistance from the administrator located at the Tom Laptop computer. Make sure that the reports window will not open, and Kaspersky Endpoint Security does not react to any of our actions. Let us allow Microsoft Windows Remote Assistance to interact with Kaspersky Endpoint Security. Modify the Kaspersky Endpoint Security Policy. Open the properties of the Kaspersky Endpoint Security 11 Workstation Policy, and switch to General Settings Exclusions. In the Scan Exclusions and Trusted Applications area, click the Settings button. Switch to the Trusted Applications tab. Specify where the Microsoft Windows Remote Assistance's executable file is located. Clear the Do Not Scan Open files, and do not inherit restrictions of the parent process checkboxes. Select the checkbox, Do Not Block Interaction with the Application Interface. Save the settings in the policy. Wait for the policy to be applied. Let us try to open the reports window again. Make sure that the reports window opens now. Click the reports button. You can see that after we have added Microsoft Windows Remote Assistance to exclusions, we can interact with the Kaspersky Endpoint Security Interface. We have allowed a remote access application to interact with Kaspersky Endpoint Security. When the administrator tries to manage Kaspersky Endpoint Security via a remote access program, such as Microsoft Windows Remote Assistance, Ultra VNC or TeamViewer, self-defense does not permit clicking anything in the Kaspersky Endpoint Security window. If you need to manage Kaspersky Endpoint Security via a remote access program, and self-defense will not allow this, configure an exclusion.